Oh. You? I gotta go. Good to see you. Brought you some flowers. I know it's like bringing sand to the beach with you, but I don't well, know. Well, this ain't no beach. Yeah, that's true. Here, I'll set these Thank right here. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Good to see you. How are you? I'm all right. I'm a little beat up physically from my time in New Zealand. Have you seen anybody since you got back? I've seen Ariana. Oh, you have? Yeah, but I mean, we haven't talked. That know. ship has sailed. I have no idea why you two are in the same house. It's ridiculous. I think it'd be the gentlemanly thing to do to move out of there and give her a space and sell the house. I mean... Or one of us can keep it because it's a great house. I've put a lot of like work and money into it. I've already had my real estate agent talk to Ariana. I sent her a letter of intent over a month ago. Like, it's been radio silence. So, so where's the way forward in this? Where's I don't the way know. forward? I just. But well, you've got to. You've I, got... I am. Listen, Lisa, like, I'm trying to figure this out. This is a lot for me, okay? Well, you created I it. Created you it. created it. I created it. I right? created it. But it's still a lot, Lisa. My friend Ali died. I have Sheena hitting me up, telling me if I need anything, please reach out to her. I'm so sorry. Okay, so Meanwhile, let me, that let me same day, let she's me... releasing things, starting rumors about me and Billy. I, I kind of think something maybe did happen with him and Billy back in the day, and they just made a pact, you know, to not tell anyone. You know what, Sheena? You know what I need from you? I need you to take a day off from dragging my name through the dirt. Hey, can I squeeze in with you guys? Hello. Yeah. Hi. Hi, Mom. I, I was just like talking to James inside, so I had a great conversation <laughs> with Lisa today. You think she wants to have something to say? She's the whole great. Yeah, I was talking with Lisa at Vanderpump Dogs, uh, and she mentioned that she's going to go up to Tahoe next week. And I invited myself jokingly. She said, yes, come, invite everyone. Like, are you inviting us? I am going to invite everyone, including you know who. Why? I'm going to invite him. Why? Because I want, I want to invite everyone. I don't want to be anywhere near either you or my ex. But I figured since you guys are already kind of in the same house, it wouldn't be that awkward. When we're in the same house, yeah. there's a mediator that yeah. goes between, and we do not run into each other or interact. I know. It's a complicated situation. And um, you guys can book your own spot, but I would love if you guys came up. You don't have to see me, or you don't have to see Tom. After everything that happened, and how he has treated you, what makes you feel the need to like stand by his side? We have a very beautiful friendship, and right now it's strained. It sucks for me. I think it's beautiful because you're a part of it, but on his end, whether you want to see this or not, and Shorty, the day will come where you see it, and you're, you're gonna look back and go, I should have gotten rid of him when that happened. He will devastate you. But we've been working through it. Like I said, it's a work in progress. 